Okay, so this is going to be the first time that a lot of our readers slash viewers are going to be learning about the show. So what can you tell them about the show's premise and your character? Uh, <laughs> the premise is we're doing a crime drama. Um, it's about Detective Robert Ironside. He's a detective that was shot and injured and then he's confined to a wheelchair. Uh, but he comes back to the force and he still does his job just as well. He's just as tough, just as smart, and just as productive a detective as he ever was. And I play Captain Ed Rollins. Um, being the captain, I'm kind of in charge of he and his group. And being in charge of he and his group because he kind of sort of employs unconventional ways, unorthodox ways to get the job done. Um, it's my job to sort of rein him in at times, to support him, but at the same time make sure he doesn't at the end of the day, everyone wants to keep their jobs, and that's up to me. Is your character ever willing to kind of step out of the bounds of uh, the strict law, per se? My character? No. We leave that all up to Ironside and his, his, his crew. So now this is a show that was previously done in the 60s. Did you watch that show for any kind of reference, or did you want this one to stand alone? I did not. Uh, I did not um, purposely. I felt that the show that we're doing is a complete revamp. It's got a whole new energy, whole new feel, a whole new attitude, so I didn't think that would be helpful in any way. And what's the role of technology in the show? Because we have different kinds of crime procedurals right now. Is this one where everyone's really tech savvy? Uh, no, we're not doing it because that's, uh, we're trying to focus more on it being a crime drama as opposed to a procedural. Procedurals focus on the process of solving the crime, where our show focuses more on how the crime affects the victims, the perpetrators, and the detectives themselves. So what's it like on the set? Is everyone getting along really well? It's like cats and dogs, man. Everybody hates each other. A bunch of jerks. No, everybody's great. Um, the great thing about this cast is everyone across the board has like wicked senses of humor. So it's very light, um, professional of course, but there's a lot of laughing and everybody's just really good. Except Blair Underwood's a diva, isn't he? Blair Underwood is so not a diva. He's just such the nicest guy. I know everyone says it, but he really is. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely.